Hi everyone, today we are going to be talking about a checksum and how to verify file integrity in Windows 8 and 10 using command prompt. You may have noticed that when you download files from some websites, they also provide a very long string of numbers and letters, called the checksum. Checksums are used not only to ensure a corrupt-free transmission, but also to ensure that the file has not been modified or tampered with, because even a tiny change made to the file will result in a completely different checksum value. The most common checksums are MD5, SHA1 and SHA2, and Windows 8 and 10 includes a utility that makes verification process quick and easy. Ok, so, for example, you have to download a very important file, and then you want to check its checksum and see if the result matches the original file. First, navigate to the folder containing the file you want to check, in my case it's downloads. Then press and hold the Shift key on your keyboard and right-click inside the window. As you can see, the Shift key adds a new function to the menu. Click Open PowerShell window or Open Command window here if you're Windows 7 or 8 user. Now type sortutil space dash hash file space, type the file name with the extension, or you can just copy it and paste by right-click of the mouse, space, type MD5, and press Enter. And here's MD5 checksum that matches the original value. In case if you need SHA1 checksum, press the up arrow key to repeat the command and simply change MD5 to SHA1 and press enter. The value is also matches the original checksum. And if you need SHA256, 384 or 512 checksums, simply type it after the name of the file and hit enter. In some situations it may be a very useful and beneficial tool, especially if you download files from unknown sources or torrent sites, so you can check if it's the same as the original file or maybe the file has been modified or even contains viruses. 